folks, it is Hobbs here back with you on a late, late Saturday night, just getting off work, and I wanted to do your Sunday Horror Cult Exploitation Film of the Week. We are focusing on the 1989 film that was out in June of 1989 by Peter Jackson, the director of The Lord of the Rings and Dead Alive. We have Bad Taste. That is correct. I do have it on this Mill Creek pack. I do have a couple other versions of this film. The only reason I'm using this particular pack is because I'm also watching some of the films on the pack currently at this time. So let's go over this film. So the budget on this film was anywhere between $11,000 to $25,000. And I believe the reason why the budget was slightly edited was because Peter Jackson was filming this movie on the weekends with his friends. They were improvising most of the weekends for this film. And uh, I guess there was a company that would assist with the budget that liked where they were going so much that when they were running out of budget, they said, hey, let's help out. So they got a little bit of a boost in the budget and for right reasons, too. Absolutely spectacular reasons. <laughs> um, the plot of the film is you have these aliens that are taking over the world and have taken over most of the world, if not all of the world, harvesting humans and making them into fast food meals for their fast food franchise. That is correct. They are wanting to harvest humans, cook them, marinate them, <laughs> Put them in seasoning and make them into their fast food franchise. You heard me correctly. They want to make them into chicken nuggets, burgers, soups. And they basically want to compete with Wendy's and McDonald's, okay? That's what they're trying to do. <laughs> and that is the plot of the film. And you have these four guys that are survivors that are trying to combat the aliens to stop the world from being taken over and becoming a combo. Literally. So let's get into my thoughts on this absolute fantastic film. Uh, this film is absolutely astounding to me because of the budget. What they were able to do with this film, with the budget, was astonishing. I mean, really, I, there had to have been more money somewhere else that that's not accounted for. The effects were that good. If you like effects and you like gore, and you like schlotz, and you like uh, just slapstick horror comedy, this is for you. It's absolutely for you. Um, I, I, I really can't recommend this enough, just based on that alone. And the storyline, maybe not as amazing to some people, but the schlock in the film... Is really what you're going for. I mean, you get humored. You get, you know, people may easily be offended by some of the body parts being ripped off and a guy holding his head together with brains coming out of his head. I mean, you know, and I, I've heard in Australia, certain parts of Australia, until censorship was, was no longer, would even have this film in some parts of Australia. So, uh, Andrew Ballin will have to let us know more about this, this particular film. Andrew, comment, buddy, if you're watching this, and give us some insight in the comments. However, I absolutely love this movie from start to finish. It is absolutely brilliant. Um, the effects, what they were able to do with the film. The aliens were hysterical. Uh, I mean... I can't find a flaw with the film. If you like wild eye films, this is a must watch. If you like low budget horror, this is a must watch. If you like gore, period, it's a must watch. If you like Peter Jackson, this is his first official film. It's a must watch. If you are a person trying to be a director, this is where you want to start. Absolutely love this movie. Bad taste. Uh, is absolutely fantastic. And yes, I hope to upgrade down the road and get a little bit better copy or transfer. I almost like the granny transfer that I have on this. Even though this is a Mill Creek set, I, <laughs> I almost like the granny in the transfer. It's 
It's crazy. It's silly. I can tell it's a VHS transfer, but go out and check out Bad Taste, because this movie is absolutely on point. You've got aliens versus human beings trying to fight to save the world and basically keep the human beings at bay so they can cook them, or the human beings can get rid of the aliens so they don't become like a franchise of fast food. That's basically what you have here. Let me know your thoughts on this film. If you've seen Bad Taste, let me know your history with Bad Taste. Let me know your thoughts, everything. If you're a Peter Jackson fan, rank these for me in the comments. Guys, have a wonderful Sunday. This is Hobbs. I'm going to go to bed. I'm tired. But I'm not too tired to not watch Bad Taste as I just finished watching it again. What an absolute blast and a pleasure to revisit. All right, guys. See you tonight on the Midnight Hour. Peace.